We're back again with some more. And drowned. That's right. Uh, we are. I don't. I think. I think the the plan was for today. We're gonna go get the alchemist, and complete some quests going off in that direction. Um, but a lot of new stuff came out. I don't think I'm gonna get to most of it in this episode. But uh, maybe we'll touch on some things. I'm not sure. Uh, but let's just get right into it. Yeah, let's go. I guess the first thing that I do want to get into. Can it? I can sit! Oh, it's facing the wrong. Can I? Oh, <laughs> it's facing the wrong direction. But we can sit! Um, I don't. Y you can't. I guess you can't sit on the benches, which is kind of weird. But you can sit on furniture now. Most furniture. So that's awesome. That's really exciting. Uh. That, that's pretty much it. I know there's also round doors and windows. Let's take a look at this. Um, I actually kind of want to make this real quick. We can actually put a door on our our base. Uh, I definitely need to mess with our inventory a little bit. So let's grab that. And... Backpack. Yeah. I select a place, thank you. Hey, look, it's like perfect, perfect fit. Kind of. We'll do that, and then I'm gonna... Oh my goodness, can I please, thank you. <laughs> it wouldn't let me select anything. Got that, and I just wanna delete. No? Can I not? That's strange. Oh, maybe maybe I need to pick this up first. Backpack is full. That's wonderful. Okay. <laughs> pick that up. And then there we go. this and now we can add this into the mix yeah look at a little hobbit hole I love it oh that looks fantastic it's amazing all right let's get rid of a bunch of stuff um oh that's right they did UI change stuff uh shift shift R Ooh, that's nice I like that, I like that. Oh, that's, I love that a lot, actually. Shift R. Shift R, yeah! All right, credit parts can go in there. Um, a lot of the stuff needs to be Pretty organized. Uh, nope. This? Yeah. Manufactured stuffs, uh, uh, dried fur. That sparks, right? We'll do this. We need salt in there. Bone blocks. Bone blocks. We put in here. Oh yeah, I put purple berries there for a reason. Okay. I think that's it, right? The rest of everything is just. What can I upgrade? So that one's at twenty. That one's fully upgraded. One at twenty-three. So let's upgrade this. Oh, but this is level nine. Hold on. I just, I just want to see. I need all of our coins. Hands equipment. Hatchet. Oh yeah, level 10, 25. It's a lot better. Uh, Wolf Snarl Longbow. Yeah, the Wildwood Shortbow is the one that we got. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna upgrade this. Ooh. Okay. Oh, really? Only to that. Hmm. It's 
do fire magic damage, but this also does piercing and shroud magic damage. We'll have to, we'll have to mess with it, test it out a little bit, you know? See how that's gonna work. Uh, this, I'm gonna salvage, salvage that, salvage this. Don't have a lot of arrows, so that's something we gotta fix. that one. Alright. Nope. Not what I wanted. That way. Got plenty of bombs. Uh, and I need to make arrows. I really, really need to make arrows. So what kind of arrows can I make? Try manual crafting. Uh, wood arrows, and then I know her. She's the one that makes our better ones. Arrows. Scrap arrows. So twigs and metal scrap. So that's, we're going to do that. Makes 50 in one go. So I need 10 metal scrap, 10 twigs. Here, perfect. A little craft, about 100. That should be plenty. That's, that's gonna be nice. Put those, and we'll go to bed since it's nighttime. Like I said, I think the uh, quest for today is, uh, the mission for today, we're gonna go get the alchemist, and on the way there, we're gonna go um, basically complete a few quests. That's gonna be the objective. There we go. Wonderful. Um, and can I? I can't upgrade this, can I? Upgrade altar. I need shroud cores. Oh, no, no. That just... Not that. Strength and flame. That's what I'm thinking of. I need a scavenger matron head. Uh, but everything else we have... Well, except for five sparks. I don't, I don't remember how much I have, but... I don't think we have five of them. Okay, but our objective now is to go to here. I think we're gonna go Ancient Spire, lie to these, right? Yeah, I think we'll do that. We'll, we'll go to the we'll go to the Spire, and then we'll just kind of fly to the uh, the other west. Let's go that way. Got a bunch of stuff down there. First is that one. So we'll leap off. I love the gliding in this, it's so much fun. Looks like we're gonna head into this little Camp. Actually, I kind of want to go to this tower that's right here. I just want, I just want to check this out. What is this? What, a, what is this? Ooh, I like it. Oh. Buddy, home. Really like it. Spooky. Oh, hello. You're terrified. Get out of here. There we go. Okay. How do oh, that's not Ah That's the <laughs> Like, what's the button to dodge? Oh, crap. That hurt. I'm, uh... I'm to get used to this again. Um, eat. Berries. Is that it? There really wasn't much here. A little wall there. No? 
Okay. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, there's so much here. Oh, there's so many of you guys. All right, we're running. We're running. I forgot how to lock on and... I'm gonna eat these. Ah, no! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Go away. Go away. He's coming. Oh, he's coming. Get out of my way. No! Be gone. Foul creature. Ooh. Okay, there we go. That was terrifying, but we did it. <laughs> All right. Well, now we're in a new area to explore. Oh, is that a chest over there? I'm seeing it right on the right on the edge, right over there. That's great. Yeah, whatever. Lots of plant fiber. Can't get all of it, I guess. Can I take it, please? Take as much of this as we can. Plant fiber is really good for us. And I think there's some of these are just actual corn. Yeah. We got corn, ladies and gentlemen. Don't know what we can turn it to. We can turn it to popcorn, most likely. I think popcorn's good for stamina. I think. Could be wrong on that. That's not it. Ah, there we go. Harvest Homestead. Make sure it's that waypoint. But I want to check all of these buildings since we're here. Got some wolves. How did I miss that? There we go. Put on some bears. Oh, I definitely need these. Honey is really nice. Ooh. Whoa! Secret floor! Bandage. Secret floor chambers. A lot of things for these. Okay. All right, so these are these are pretty good to uh, destroy. Yeah, I'd say the uh, the little cloth things, are pretty cloth boxes, are pretty good to, to destroy. Brilliant flower, tomatoes. Excited to see what other like, what kind of food stuff can you make? Gotten, uh, too deep into that. Ow! You, you dang wolf! It's rude. Yeah. Oh, ooh, got some lore here. A bird deep, they came in droves again yesterday, sunburnt heathens. They twist and mangle their bodies whenever they bow to their gods, their idols, the ancients. Too many mouths to feed, the only, they only want alms? I'd send them back to the Kindle waste. They won't fool me, I buried my treasure in the fence law underneath the small shelter not far from here. They won't find it when it's hidden beneath the mud. Tonight I'll sleep deeply. Treasure. Treasure. What else we got? The room here? I want some. Eh, tis but a toilet. Anything? No treasure? Hmm. Ha! 
flashes. Oh, there it is. Yeah, just arrows. I mean, I guess that is useful for us, but... Okay. Check this out. Nothing. Oh, hello. Aha! Hey! Level four! Very nice. Uh, let's go ahead and check it out. Check out what we got. So we got two points. We're heading up this way. Endurance is kind of what we're going for, but was there something else? People sneaking. Eagle eye. Poison resistance? Actually, that might be that might be really good, because I know the uh, the matrons do poison. Sprinting speed increased by 10%. Stamina consumption decreased by 10%. That's actually really nice. Let's do that. We do plan on doing a lot of running. And I think... Yeah, double jump. We can do some double jump. That'd be nice. Oh, yeah. I can already tell the difference. Holy snap. These wolves did a number on these goats. They literally just trapped them back here and... Like, slaughtered them. <laughs> That's crazy. Right, Harvest Homestead. Anything? These. A resin. And mainly just wood. <gasps> is that what I think it is? That's the chest. Yeah. Oh, just the mace. That's fine. I think we did literally mark off where we've been, but we've been to all those houses. Not this way. Towards the uh, the chapel. Is that what it is? Ah yeah. Woodguard. Ladder, thank you. Here, ooh, chest. Ooh. Some spells. Not that we'll use them, but they look interesting. Got some more lore here as well. A refuge. A small caravan of refugees arrived today from the Kindle Waste. A long journey. I've never been good with strangers, but they were there was no time to tattle. I dove into work, dressing the wounds. A battle for life and death, even now. Sadly, some uh, sadly, some lost. We, uh, we put them to rest in the crypts below. May the northern winds guide them to the afterlife. There's one who might live despite it all, a deep leg wound, but maybe not too far gone. The wounded Salem smiles a lot, says he owes me his life. Just luck, I think. I think Salem, I think we read a story earlier about a Salem and a maybe this, this nurse or this doctor. Oh, that was a waste. Oh, the skelly boy. Oh, chest. Yeah. Uh, more spells. More lore. Not, I don't want to sit. What, eh? A new season. The new arrivals have wasted no time breaking ground, building something. Their termination is fanatical. A flame sanctum, Salem says. Some nights I've lingered near the caravan, Salem insists. Over the fire, they talk of their home, the sands, and the creeping ruin. So much sorrow. Salem says, I am like a daffodil, the first sign of spring. He is a fool, though a sweet one. Very cute. I think we read something before where they, it was a, it was a while ago, at least for me it was a while ago, they uh, read something, uh, I read something about two lovers, basically. Um, but they unfortunately passed dark in here. Got more lore, though. One foot in the grave. We laid another one to rest today. Poor folk. Traveled all the w all this way looking for respite, only to find ruins and scraps. This church won't hold. Helen said as much. The wind crow the wind howl the wind howls and forges new paths into our halls every night. 
Our roof has torn has been torn apart by the storms, and we're too busy tending to the caravan's people to patch it up. Yet we must stay. We are needed here, and will hardly find shelter elsewhere. Burying these vagabonds next to the relics and artifacts feels wrong to me, but perhaps Helen is right. Maybe the old times must make way for new customs and rites. So they started burying some of the dead down here next to some artifacts, which there's one down there. Can't, I can't open these. I don't think any of these are open. Yeah. But as, I feel like, I think as soon as you open this, though, they all open. Hey, Ring of Stamina. Okay! Alright, you guys came real fast. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, we need to run. We need to run. We need to run. Uh, health. Can I equip my bow, please? There we go. Holy smokes. Very nice. Okay. Getting a little better, getting back into the swing of all this. Everything? Chests, there's just enemies. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. So all we got was a uh, a ring of stamina, which is fine. It's not great, but it's it'll do. So we can check it out, see what'll. Oh, wow, we are already full. Yeah, sigil ring of the elder guard. So it's eight plus eight, eight stamina plus ten health. We got life leech chance. Honestly, I might want to switch this for stamina. Give a stamina regen. That other ring is cool, but I mean, we're only using a bow, and at likely chance, I don't know if it's going to be useful. But it's not right now. Stamina is probably going to be a little bit better. That'll be useful. That's ah, just an empty room. Weird. What's up here? Hey, a chest. Just some fiber and whatnot. Okay, fiber is really good for uh, string, which is good for bandages, so I'm definitely taking that. Oof, that was bright. Holy crap. Oh, bees! There we go. Got some, uh... Beehives? Come on. Can I get that one, please? Maybe? Nope. I guess I might have to chop it down. I want that honey. Honey and wax, give it! It's mine! Oh. Interesting. I guess it just fell. 
And our backpack is full. Anything we can drop? We don't need the wood necessarily, so we can delete that. Um, twenty corn. I probably just eat this one. Yeah, we'll use it. Why not? It doesn't hurt. Uh, we're gonna salvage that. Huh? I want to salvage the item stack. It cannot be recovered. Yeah, that's fine. That's what I want. I guess I could just drop these two because I'm not using spells, right? So like these are basically pointless I'm gonna just get rid of those and everybody's gonna yell at me about it, but whatever Go and I guess we completed that Did we? Completed Or what it was called. Oh, I don't know. All right. Well, uh, next salt mine location: a story of fire. Let's do a story of fire, then the alchemist, and we'll kind of make our way back up to this salt mine. I think that's a good idea. I need to claim the rest of this stuff. Can I get up this way? Oh, that is way up there. Uh, might need to go backtrack a little bit. Yeah, I'll take this. This this will take us all the way up there. House over here. Get this out. Wolves. Oh, the headshot. Another headshot. Very nice. Rats. Ah, more rats. chest. Apprentice wand. I'll we'll have to salvage that. Another good old chest. I'm not taking those. Alright. Uh, this way. Hey, we gotta find another one of these. Bad. I think those those are just used for like basically checkpoints. So if I die out here, I'll respawn at that. Grab them all the way back at our base. Which does help. Because walking in this game kind of takes a while. Here it 
is right over there. Story of Rot. Or is this the story of fire? What is this? Obelisk. Whoa, 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 lag, alright. In a world of des or in a world destined for ruin, humanity will fade as all beings do. Their light will flicker and die untouched by the eternal flame. Meaningless and minuscule in the face of near endless insight burning brightly. Turning to dust as we turn to fire, an endless cycle of ruin and turmoil. Bunch of lore here. Got some boots. Tired. Uh, we would pretend to read them as children, but now the obelisks hide their truths. I was a fool for thinking I could find a solution to my problems here. No one hears my prayers, and I feel so tired. I wish you were by my side, brother. Forgive me. That's one. We reach that. Next is the alchemist. Go ahead and salvage that. All right, I need it. Wanders boots. Regen. Oh, whoa, whoa, hold on. Okay, so not as much defense, but it gives me more stamina regen. Which I like, so we're gonna do that. here. Oh, I see a a man's right there. Get out of here. Whoa! They're firing back! You missed. There we go. Oh, we got bombs! I thought I was far away from that. Oh! Ah! Step in your own trap, fool. Very nice. What is this? Hey! Golden chest. I will freely take that. Whoa! The wailing blade! I got that before. So that I think we can uh I think we bring that back to the blacksmith? I think that's part of one of his quests. Or he mentions it uh, when you when you have it on you and you talk to him. So. Actually, I don't know. Is that better than what we have? Because what? Our hatchet, level 10, 25 damage, level 3, 14 damage. Yeah, our, uh, our hatchet's better. Just a tad bit. Oh, that's right. This whole place is one uh, big encampment. Forgot about this. Well, let's go through the front door. Uh, come on. Nice. Him. Yeah, I'm stuck in mud. Oh. Just those two so far? Looks like. Take out this side. Oh, you shot your own dude. I didn't know you could do that, but you did. No. Some metal scrap instead. Some bombs. Ooh, what? Here, people. Oh. Oh, 
Gotcha. Thought you could take me on. Well, you're wrong. Ooh. Nope, not that good. <laughs> I'm really not getting these, like, fantastic weapons. I mean, I guess I am, I am in a slightly lower level area for what I have now. I went to high level areas first and then went on to... Now I'm in low level areas. Like that. You. Pretty you. Get exploded. <laughs> I love being able to do that. Oh. Empty our backpack. We have stuff we gotta salvage. Oh, nope, not salvaging that. I don't wanna sal salvage it because might use it. I don't know. Uh, we'll start. Oh, that's right. We had that one. Yeah, let's just go ahead and salvage that one. You yeah, know. Then we'll go ahead and salvage that. Nicely done. Got some more lore. Stashed our hull. That hull. Oh wait. Oh, we we did that. We did that. That was the stash that we found with the golden chest. Holy crap! It's dark. We're good there. All right, anybody home? Hello. Ah, welcome to your demise. Oh. Got another provisional scythe. Salvage that. Missed me. Right. Make sure there's no secrets or anything. Secret rooms, chests. Hey, you see, right there. Always got to keep an eye out. Always going to find something. And it goes down and up. Okay, so secret chest. With a little bit of a puzzle. Not really, it's just spikes on the floor. Well, that's a trap, more or less. Ah, something we cannot use. Salvage. We're going to delete that. No, okay. Easy trap. And does this... Oh, there's a chest there. Got a bomb. I mean, bombs are useful. I just don't use them a lot, so... in here. I got a couple. Perfect. Again, we're a little high level for this area. <laughs> um, collect some arrows. Nice. And the alchemist. Hooray! We did it. Got that completed. I think that was that was it for that part. Um, and then we have one more a scavenger staff. So we stash. We already did that. And then we have the salt mine location. Um, so we'll should be able to glide most of the way there from here. That's what we're gonna do. And I don't know how much longer it's going to be nighttime, but we'll go ahead and lie ourselves over. Oh, we really didn't go that far. 
Like, I just, I, I can't wait till we get the upgraded, uh, the upgraded, um, paraglider, because ours is a little, it doesn't go that far. Not that great. Oh! Hi! Like, I wasn't expecting you guys, but then again, it is nighttime, so of course you would spawn. Okay. Nice. I keep forgetting you can parry in this game, too. Really? Salt mine location is below? That's... Why? Why does it gotta be in the shroud? Huh? No. Ah! We got bugs! That doesn't help me. We have lore. My faculty is sharp as ever. The thumping leads the way. A bold, beautiful pounding. It rattles my bones, but wets my palate. Uh, my shy compatriots have no taste for riches, or, it seem, or so it seems, as they departed while I slept. We had just broken into the tunnel where deep at the end, the wonderful buzzing seems to sing. No matter, more for Bertram, I say, forward ho. Bertram. Uh. Now, I want to say the buzzing that this man is hearing is all these little bugs. Yeah, it's just a whole cave of bugs. So not not particularly great. All right, hold on, I gotta heal. Out of here, you dang critters. So many. All right, get this and get out. Oh, a bronze sword. Hold on. Come on, select the frickin'. There we go. Well, let me select the uh, torch. Yeah, so this is all this is salt, right? Yeah, I think that's salt. This is supposed to be, so. Get on up out of here. I think that was what this was for, was to find that chest in the sword, which. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
right here. I don't see anything near our stuff. So maybe we're okay. Grabby, grabby. And go! Woo! I don't think I grabbed it! Okay. Oh, you hit me real hard. All right. Hey, I heal before you can actually kill me. Oh, I couldn't dodge. All right. Taking all of that. Okay. We good now? We a okay? Oh, yeah, right. We gotta destroy these things. These are what are spawning those. All the bad guys. What was that? Alright. I think it is time to try to get out of here. Being shot at. I don't like being shot at. Skyrim. Skyrim horsing it. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Killed you. Nice. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's so much worse than I thought. Oh, it's so, so bad. There we go. I want... No, I want the Trout Core. Thank you. That's what I wanted, please. Should be able to teleport out after breaking it too. Yeah, skill point. Woohoo! Awesome. Yeah. Cool. Well, we killed a shroud root. Um. And I think once we get the uh, a story. Oh, so the story of fire, I think, or ruin, and the story of rot. Once we get the uh, complete a story of rot quest, then a bunch of other. Uh, shroud root locations will appear, and then we can go take care of them. Um, awesome. Yeah, because I think the uh, story—I think it was a story of fire, because it opened up all these flame shrines. Leo. All right. Well, let's uh, teleport back home. Now that we're all done, and a lot of stuff in our inventory. I'm gonna empty all this stuff out. I commune with the flame. Another survivor awakened. The alchemist will prove helpful by crafting potions and healing tinctures. Cool, man. Thanks, bro. Right. Ah, the Wailing Blade. You claimed the Wailing Blade? I forged it for her grasp before she left me. Fine, you may wield it in her place. Pierce the Shroud's heart, Flameborn. It's what my daughter would want. Yeah, no so I think his daughter, his daughter might be gone, unfortunately. Um, but the Wailing Blade, I mean, it's it's very low level to us right now. I don't know if you can actually like upgrade it. 
I mean, you can upgrade it, but I don't think you can, like, make it, you know, any higher. So, that's fine. So, we'll start putting a bunch of the stuff away. We got a lot of stuff. Which is, again, really nice. Food. Go. See this, we can... Add that. Yeah, it's all in here. We're going to delete these, because, again, we're not going to use them. We can't, because we're only using bows and kind of physical weapons, but not really. So delete that, delete that. And anything else is in here? Nails? Nails go in there. Uh, sure, of course. Eh, well. so we need more sparks. Um get those later scout boots bronze sword yeah we're gonna sell i'm just gonna salvage these just because i mean again i can't use them a lot of bombs which is nice and oh yeah we gotta place down our uh we gotta place down balthazar this is the guy we've been talking about for a while uh -huh. so you he's in a lot of your uh your little stuff and things um little notes and lore pieces that you'll find Greetings. It's eternally magical. We are specks of dust in a world of stars, my friend. Do you dare to reach out wishing to grasp a piece of eternity? Perhaps obtaining an eternal spell would suit you. I know one was buried in an underground tomb alongside its dreadful master. You could use it to do a lot of good. So we're not using magic, but we'll still go collect it, because why not? Uh, another set of hands would be useful to us if we ever plan to expand the base. I, for one, could use more storage for my potions. I happen to know the location of another ancient vault. Why not look around? And he's talking about the carpenter, which we will go get in the next episode. Um, and then we got, you know, grinding stone, which we need to make. Now we can make actual shroud cores, uh, spiritual cane, alchemist set, and a bunch of books. So these are just decorative, placeable things. And he makes health potions for us, which is also fantastic so that is that's gonna be kind of kind of fun to mess around with and i don't think there's anything else um i do know something in the future updates i think in the road i think i talked about this before uh they plan on making it to where npcs can walk around and there will be a lot more npcs so there will be just normal citizens that you can find i think um, and then, uh, as well as these NPCs, which I think will be awesome because, as most of you know, I like building towns and cities and stuff like that, so maybe in the future we can build a full-on town and upgrade it to a city and just have NPCs walking and chilling out and doing all sorts of stuff around our place. Um, but I think that's gonna be it for this episode. We got a lot done. Um, we got some cool stuff. Uh, we got the Alchemist. Um, we'll move, we're kind of moving on. Um... Next, we're going for the Carpenter, which is uh, down here, Ancient Vault Carpenter. On the way there, we'll do the Eternal Spell and probably a love letter to Queen Jasmina. Um, and might circle back to the Story of Rot. There's going to be a lot that we might have to hit on this little run, so that's not too bad. Um, we got stuff over here. Oh yeah, the Hunter's ha uh, Hand Spindle. So we'll have to go do that a little bit later, because that, we do have a teleport that we can easily go to and get over there so that we'll do in another episode but next episode we're getting the carpenter um but we do have a new npc uh which i don't know about yet so we'll have to find them and go see what they're all about but i hope you guys enjoyed if you did leave a like down below just hit that subscribe button i appreciate all of you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye